eating right and cooking fresh isn't enough of an incentive to join this week's Things to Do, then your wallet may be just as interested as your taste buds. Cooking as a group in a team environment provides a supportive and fun way for all to eat. As you see, there's a lot of food on the table, so there will be a lot of cooking, a lot of work, so I hope everybody <laughs> will be busy. As a starter, because I suppose everybody's hungry already, we will make three varieties of hummus. I am Tamara. I come from Mexico City. Tonight uh, we make a workshop, vegetarian workshop, that I find it really, really healthy. And it's really, really friendly with the environment. IVA is an organization that encourages people to eat more uh, vegetarian and plant-based. Like today, there is a Thursday vegetarian workshop in Brussels. Um, here can people make vegetarian dishes, taste it, and we hope they like it. Eva has a different local groups uh, in Flanders and in Brussels. So there's a local Eva group, Eva Brussels. There are people, uh, volunteers who organize activities, workshops, and they give information to people. It's really easy and there's so much delicious vegetarian food that it's just a lot of fun. So I think that it's better when people start thinking really on vegetarian. Not also because it's healthy and not also because it's friendly with the environment. It's more because it's cheaper. Really, it's cheaper. It's fun to cook together and to eat together. So that's why cooking workshops are really successful. People like to do it together. They like to learn new things. Uh, you learn something and then you try it immediately. And then the next time you just do it at home for your friends or family who's coming over for dinner. I like it very much. Yes, I love it. I want to come another kind of <laughs> other time and, uh, and be part of the group because it's, it's really, really nice. Okay. 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 Cheers.